Hi friends today we will build a home automation project here we can control a multiple appliances from a smartphone through internet in addition to that the same appliances can be controlled through a smart switches or touch switches also under the absence of wifi hello friends Welcome to my YouTube channel HRB Embedded and Craft. To make this project, we just need a relay module of how many appliances we want to control. Node MCU here and a smart switches. In this video, I have shared a circuit diagram and we will see the step by step procedure to use Blink app and Blink Cloud to make home smart in my next video so i will highly recommend you to watch this complete video and after watching this video you are definitely able to build your own smart circuit within a minute as i said first i will design a circuit on breadboard and for that we need a relay board node mcu and switches and a circuit diagram is like this yes the circuit is built according to the circuit diagram is very simple we connect 5 volt supply to node mcu through a data cable these are relay boards are controlled with d5 to d8 from node mcu and switches are connected to d1 to d4 from the node mcu one led shown here is connected to d0 to identify whether the node mcu is connected with the wifi or not Now in this IoT project I have used Blink app to control relay module now let us see the demonstration of this project now the device is connected to a 5 volts through a data cable so now we will upload a code to this node MCU to run this project okay now we will open an Arduino IDE to upload the code for the node mcu for home automation so here blink simple esp8266.h library is already downloaded esp8266 wifi .h is already downloaded and it is taken as a library so here relay pin 1 2 3 4 all relay pins are connected d5 d6 d7 d8 respectively and fan pin is connected to your d9 as a pulse width modulation output switch pin 1 to a switch pin 4 all four switches are connected to a digital inputs d1 d2 d3 d4 and uh, one led is connected to a digital pin d0 to identify whether it is connected to a wifi or not so now virtual pins are selected v1 to v5 the code is given in the description itself so now will upload the code to a node mcu now we will select node mcu and it is connected to a com7 now it is ready for uploading to the node mcu okay now the code is uploaded and it shows done uploading okay here so this is the arrangement of home automation iot project so here four lamps are connected from 230 volt and one fan is connected to control the speed using a blink app and now we'll turn on a hotspot to connect our node mcu to wifi now we'll see that a green led is turned on it indicates our device is connected to a wifi so now we'll open a blink app from my device or mobile see here home automation is connected now it is an online so now we'll see these are four switches i made in the blink app and we'll explain later through this app i can control this lamps so now here this is l293d motor driver is used 
to control the speed of this motor and this L293D is connected from D9 of node MCU this will supply the pulse width modulation output or PWM output to this controller so now we will see that the speed can be controlled using slider also through this slider I can reduce or increase the speed of this this motor You can see the speed now. 